What's up, everybody? This is Gamer Man DJ. As you guys may kind of hear, my name has changed. I'm no longer using Dalen Jenkins because you're not supposed to use your actual name. That is on my fault part. But I'm switching to Gamer Man DJ because, you know, I'm a gamer and I'm a man, you know. My gender is male, so no more being specific about that. But, and also DJ is my initials, so to let you guys know that I changed my name, it's going to be Gamer Man DJ for now on, guys. And what I have for you guys today is some pretty good content. It's more like a commentary. It is me basically showing you guys one of my favorite gun classes. And just wanted to also say about the my previous videos, you know, the zombie glitches. I have done pretty good with those, you know, but... Like, my requested likes, I'm not getting, like, I'm getting close, but, you know, I have a specific, you know, reach of likes that I need to be required to get make another video, guys. You know, I bring the content to you guys, so in request, or, you know, in return, I ask for likes, guys. But, um, yeah, I'm sorry I haven't brought no videos to you guys here lately, it's because, you know, school's been up and started. And, you know, not have very much time because, you know, I got to do my homework and I got to eat and, you know, do all that typical stuff that everybody does every day. But I have brought you guys a video today because I had kind of a free day today and I hope you guys like it. So if you guys like today's video, please leave a like, comment how you guys think on it, subscribe if you haven't. If you like my content, guys, I really appreciate it. I'm really trying to, you know, get my YouTube channel up. I apologize for my graphics. I'm trying to get some type of capture device. I just need to work up and get some money to save up for it. But anyways, guys, let's go ahead and jump into this. As you can see, I'm using a Peacekeeper. Peacekeeper is a very awesome gun, guys. I love the Peacekeeper. Best gun they, I think, in my, in my opinion, second to the MSMC. Both great submachine guns, very good. Thought I had that person, but I guess, you know, I was a little too late on that one. This gun is one of the very top notch guns I think there is in this game. Because it's just, you know, it's got really good accuracy and, you know, that the aiming sight's pretty good. I love the aiming sight on this gun. When I'm playing in games, I always see Peacekeeper on the death list. It's people always, you know, killing other people with it. Get yeah, multi-kills. I'll show you guys the type of gun attachments I have and perks and all that. I'm just showing you guys a little bit of gameplay before I go and tell details. And that was, you know, strange right there. I had not seen that that person was there. But, you know, it helped out with my next score streak. And with this gun, guys, you can get quite a bit of kill streaks. It's very easy. Hardcore, I just love because... You know, if you're on, you know, a good streak and you're killing people, it's very great. You know, you guys can get a lot of kills easily with only two bullets. You know, sometimes one, depending on where exactly you hit the person. But still, I just love hardcore. It's my favorite map. All my friends rage on it, but I'm actually good at it. You're like, DJ, why do you always play on here? It's like, because it's just my favorite gameplay. I love playing on it. You know, it's very awesome. You know, it's actually even now to where, not you know, a Remington shotgun is way overpowering compared to, you know, a submachine gun. You know, everything is basically equal. And as you guys see there, that was a pretty sweet triple kill right there. It got me my Orbital v stat, my Stealth Chopper. Very awesome. I love hardcore. And now I'm going to show you guys what I, you know, what's my perks and my attachments on here. So, of course, as I've been talking about, the Peacekeeper. Let's go ahead and put, you know, a little nice sweet camo on here. I don't know. What should I use? I'm going to use Cyborgs. That, you know, that's one of my favorite camos there is on here. I don't have all the DLC camos unlocked, but, you know, it's one of my favorite. So, my first attachment is Fast Mag. As you guys could have possibly seen in the video, I reloaded quite a bit. My, um, you know, first perk is Lightweight. Second perk, Toughness. Third is Dexterity. I have Lightweight because I can run faster. Toughness you don't necessarily need. That's more of a perk you need in core considering, you know, you know, um, toughness. It doesn't make you flinch as much to where your aiming ends up going up as you get shot. So it's harder to aim while you're getting shot. There's nothing you really, you don't need toughness on here because, you know, you get shot two times anyways, you're dead. But I just use it anyways. My third perk is dexterity because I love to aim quickly right after I stop because you know that one enemy is going to jump out right in front of you and get you off guard. So that's why, and also with that situation, you got to be good at hip firing. With hip firing, some people good at, some people aren't. It's just how you play the game. So as I said, my first attachment is, you know, fast mag. 
My second attachment is quick draw. Quick draw is one of my favorite because you can aim a lot faster than most people who don't have it. It also helps with the LMGs. If you aim faster, you know, hurry up and catch somebody right before they get you. It's awesome. I love fast mag and I love quick draw. It really helps out the gun. And my third attachment is it, it, I switch between different things. Usually I either use FMJ, even though hardcore you don't necessarily need it, or I use suppressor, you know, because it kind of speedens your rate of fire. And also, I would also use foregrip for, you know, better accuracy, you no know, no recoil. But even though Peacekeeper's already good with accuracy and hardly any recoil. But yeah, I need to use between those. And yeah, those are... The attachments I use, guys, you know, it's a pretty good setup. It's kind of similar, like, to my MSMC that I use. Except most of the time, I'll either have a suppressor or, you know, I'll have FMJ. Because, you know, one of my favorite things. You know, also have primary gunfire. You know, so you can have that third attachment. That's the things I use there. And the second, or, you know, last of all, I use first perk greed. And I always have my hard lines so you can get all your score streaks a lot easier, a lot faster. You can get, you know, a stealth chopper and orbital V set after catching about two flags, you know, get about five kills, I think, and you'll already have them already up and ready. Use it for next round, or if it's just the game is just like starting, you can already use it for that round, guys. Very awesome gun. Let's go into some more gameplay and show you guys how this is done. And we are back, guys. You know, here is the gun gameplay. Now, already starting off this game, I already got me a stealth chop. I already got that overall B set already lined up and ready to go. Really useful for the rest of my teammates. You know, come out here, take out that carry package. Me and some other dude, you know, we just take out two choppers at the same time. Very cool. And a lot of people, like, they don't like to capture these flags, you know. 200 free points, who wouldn't want to capture these flags? Also, getting kills off of it, you know, you're getting 100 to 200 points. Just kill somebody while you're on the fly capturing it. And then once you capture it, there's an extra 200 points, guys. You know, it's really, you know, you got to be smart on capturing these points so you can earn up to get your score streaks to help you out through the gameplay and help you guys team win the game. You know, you got to, you know, you can't just think about yourself. I'm not trying to be rude or nothing. You also got to think about your teammates. You know, you're helping them out too, getting their score streaks, which will make you guys beast up the gameplay within the game. And, you know, you know, you guys just, you know, um, sorry for this, but you guys get closer to winning. You know, helps you out, gives you an advantage. Man, this these orbital V sats. I don't know why this dude. He was just, I guess, he wasn't playing. Yeah, he just sitting there. As you guys can see, I am 24 and 6. And, you know, just keep on ranking up them kills. Wow. Wow. And I think somebody's going to catch me off guard. I don't know how he got me, but, you know, hurry and got those guys. That was a pretty good. You know, that's what I'm talking about, where. You know, quick draw comes in advantage. Is I can aim really quick. You know how those guys hurry up and try to turn. You know, I'm already aimed on them to take them out. See that guy? He just take him out. He wasn't paying attention to his surroundings. You know, you gotta be. This game you gotta be smart. You gotta, you know, pay attention to your surroundings. You gotta have the good guns and right there. There's another example of having quick draw. You can really get yourself, you know, ranked up. You know, get a lot of points. Get your score streaks. You know, very good. And make sometimes make your. Make the enemy's rage quit, which makes you feel good about yourself and your teammates, you know, kind of get you some popularity. You see, this this gun is just awesome, guys. Like, I'm just trying to show you guys that, you know, with this gun, it just helps you out because the attachment itself just makes the gun just so more perfect. And if you're stealthy and you know how to aim, which me, my aim is not all that great, but... You know, if you're smart, you can duck, you know, lay down and hurry and pop up and know exactly where your enemy's at. Shoot him off guard. Well, not off guard because, you know, he's paying attention. But, you know, shoot him and get him, you know. There's a little bit of help to your score streaks, help to your team, you know, because they could have been going to capture a flag. And if you would have if you would have died, you probably could have gotten it while you guys weren't there. You know, this gun is just amazing. Plus, if you guys want to have any other attachments, you guys can go ahead and try them out. I'm just telling you my three favorite attachments, my three favorite perks, you know. It's very good, guys. You know, it's very awesome. I hope you guys like this video. It's a little bit different than what I have done. And as you guys see, I just got me another Orbital V-Sat, another Stealth Chopper. This gun is amazing. But, yeah, I'm going to try and cut down just a tiny bit. I'll still do it. I'm hoping to get some type of sponsorship so, you know, it helps me out in the future. But as you guys can see, it's 196 to 119. I'm coming out at 42 and 8, guys. Very good gameplay, and we win the game here right now. 200 to 120, 42 and 8, 
five catches, six defense, 5,235 score, guys. I hope you guys like this video. And, you know, comment what you guys like about it. You know, leave some in, you know, description, guys. Help me out with my channel, guys. And I will see you guys on the next video.